Hello guys, this is YouTube channel Path and Lighter and this video is on the topic statistics for APFC exam conducted by UPSC and any other exams. This is presented by me, Deepak Jaiswal. Now I am inspector since 2006, rank 161 in the APFC and I have to resign in 2014 for APFC Ahmedabad. Now coming to the topic, mean. As you say mean, mean here is arithmetic mean or we can say it is as average mean or arithmetic mean or average all are same thing so coming to the formula mean x is equal to sum of all the observations upon total number of observations okay so now coming to the example there were five people were asked about the time in a week they is spending doing social work in their community so total number of people is 5. Now they said 10, 7, 13, 20 and 15 hours they work respectively. Find the mean time in a week devoted by them for social work. So we have to find mean time or <coughs> average time. So as we know mean or average is equal to sum of all the observations. So observation is 10 plus 7 plus 13 plus 20 plus 15. That is 65 and total number of observations total number of observations is 5 so it's 65 oblique 50 65 oblique 5 is equal to 13 clear now coming to median median is when the number of observations is odd like if there are 9 observations 9 or the suppose here example is given of 13 suppose if there is 13 13 observations then the median will be 7, 13 plus 1 oblique to 8th number that is 7th number, 7th observation will be the median and if it's for 16 then it is even then 16 oblique 2 will be 8 so 8 will not be the answer but it will be the mean of 16 by 2 and 16 plus 1 by 2 so 8 this means that 8 observation and ninth observations mean will be the median of the that series. So we solve by example, it will be clear, it will become clear. Suppose there are nine students whose height whose height is given 155, 160, 145, 149, 50, 147, 152, 144, 148. So for finding median, first of all we arrange all these data in ascending order. So after after arranging it in ascending order, so it becomes 144. Then 145, then 147, then 148, then 149, then 150, then 152, then 155, then 160. So after arranging, since it, there are 9 students, so the median will be n plus 1 upon 2th observation. Since n9 is odd, this means 10 oblique 2 and 5th fifth observation. 5th fifth observation will be the <coughs> fifth observation will be the median of the digit. So after, after ascending order, Arranging it in ascending order, the fifth position will be the median of this series. So remember, in median we have to arrange it in them. arrange it in ascending order. Suppose if instead of nine students or nine observation, there is ten ten observations given. Then what will we do? First, it will look at ten oblique to five, and ten plus one oblique to eleven oblique to is six. This means this will be fifth and sixth mean of Fifth observation plus sixth observation. This means fifth observation plus sixth observation oblique to the answer which comes is median of the that series. Now coming to mode. Mode is simple thing. It is the value of the observation which observe occurs most frequently. That is an observation with the maximum frequency is called the mode. Suppose a series is given. 2, 2, 2, 3, 3, 4, 4, 4, 5, 5, 6, 6, 7, 7, 9, 9, 9, 10. So here 9 occurs 4 times. This means the me the mode is 9. It's simple. It is used by ready-made government and soul industries to make great use of this measure of the central tendency. General knowledge, these industries decide which side of the product should be produced in large numbers. Now there is a formula 3 median is equal to mode plus 2 mean. So it's clear mean, median and mode. 
Now we will solve examples of series. Suppose the marks obtained by 30 students of class 10 of a certain school in mathematics paper consisting of 100 marks are presented in table below. Find the mean of the marks obtained by the student. So 10 marks 1, 10 to 21, 20 to 36, 3, 40 to 4, 53, 56, 64. So we have to find what is the mean. So first of all we have to add all the numbers. 10 plus 20 plus 36 plus 40 plus 50 plus 26 plus 60 plus 70 plus 72 plus 80 plus 88 plus 92 plus 95. This will be the sum of observations. 10 plus 20 plus 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 plus. This will be sum of all the observations. And this is 1 plus 1 plus 3 plus 4 plus. This will be number of observations. So upon this we will get the mean. Summing all the marks upon number of students got that mark total number of students got that mark we will get the mean now coming to suppose here they are given direct numbers but suppose interval is given if then what will you do here like 10 to 25 number of students 2 25 to 43 40 to 55 7 55 to 76 70 to 85 6 and 85 to 106 in such cases we find midpoint or called middle part middle point for finding out middle point of class mark we add the lower limit and the upper limit and divide it by 2 so this becomes 10 plus 10 plus 25 by 2 this becomes 17.5 this will become 32.5 this will become 47.5 and so on so 17.5 32.5 47.5 62.5 and then for finding mean of that series we will multiply this by frequency that is number of students so class mark into frequency upon number total number of students will be mean of the that series now coming to another question suppose a survey is conducted on 20 households in the locality by group of students resulted in the following frequency table for the number of family members in the household family size is 1 to 3 there are 7 families such 3 to 5 8 families 5 to 7 2 families 7 to 9 2 families and 9 to 11 1 family we have to find mode mode of this data if it is not in series like 1 to 3 1 to 3 3 to 5 then we will simply find out the maximum number of repeated data but since uh, since it is given in this series uh, in this interval time we have to calculate it in different way however if you if you want to get simply the mode we will find which number is which series is represented both that is 3 to 5 the family size belonging to 3, 5 and maximum number of family that is 8. So the answer will be the model class or the mode will be in between 3 to 5 or the model class will be 3 to 3 to 5. So lower limit of that model class will be 3. Upper limit will be 5. Class size is difference between these two that is 5, 5 minus 3, 2. Frequency will be frequency will be 8 that is how many number of families. F0, F0 will be preceding preceding to this class so 1 is 1 to 3 is preceding to this class and there is frequency 7 f2 is succeeding class frequency of succeeding class that is 2 now, now let us substitute these values in the formula that is mode is equal to l plus f1 minus f0 upon 2 f1 minus f2 minus f0 into h therefore the mode of the data above is 3.286 this type of this type of question doesn't generally come in the exam but even then it's simple so do remember now suppose we have to find the median of the following data which gives the marks out of 50 obtained by 100 students in the 10 so 20 marks obtained uh, number of 6 6 students obtained 20 marks 28 students obtained 29 marks 24 students obtained 28 marks and 20 students obtained 25 marks so since we have to find the median the first step we have to do is rearrange it in ascending order so after rearranging this becomes 20 25 28 29 33 38 42 and 43 now number similarly number of students will also be arranged now coming to cumulative frequency what is cumulative frequency this is frequency number of students is frequency and cumulative frequency is adding the frequency in subsequent time and period this becomes cumulative frequency like here 6 then 6 now 6 plus 20 will be 26 
now next will be 26 plus 24 that will become 50 then 50 plus 28 becomes 78 78 plus 15 becomes 93 93 plus 4 we get 97 97 plus 2 become 99 99 plus 1 become 100 so this is cumulative frequency and this is frequency so got the difference now here n is equal to 100 as we have see, as we have seen it so which is even so we have no we know that the median will be 50 100 by 250 plus 100 plus 1 by 100 plus 1 by 2 that is 51 yeah 50 so the median will be the mean of 58 and 51st observation so will be the 58th observation is 28 we have seen it and 51 observation will fall in 29 so the mean will be the median will be 28 plus 29 upon 2 that is 28.5 so this will be the answer so this is all it subscribe to this channel for free education promote it among friends for any queries or suggestions, mail us at pathelighter at gmail.com. Thank you.